Assad today said his government has a duty to destroy terrorists to save thousands of lives. Unbelievable. And let's say the Syrian president is referring to the rebel fighters whenever he says terrorists. And activists claim Syrian government troops have murdered more than 14,000 people. In an interview with Iranian state television, the Syrian President Bashar al-Assad rattled off a long list of accusations against the West, including a claim that the United States is ignoring al-Qaeda's presence in Syria. Greg Palcott with the news reporting from Damascus, the capital city, and like all Western journalists in the country, Greg is there with the permission of the Syrian regime, and it is monitoring his reporting. Greg? Hey, Shannon, we're coming to you over the phone uh, because courtesy of the regime, the comms have been cut out Thursday night leading up to Friday prayers here the, the time for protest and they're cracking down on that there was another incident today here in the heart of the city take a look another hit to the heart of this regime two bombs set off in this parking lot in the center of Damascus no one killed but a lot of cars destroyed and it happened right across the street from the Palace of Justice the civil court here in Damascus the message sent Again, after seeing another attack this week, it was well planned. This time, no death on the bombs were small. It's a big, dramatic scene and fire. Rebels have never gotten this close to the center of the capital. Meanwhile, tensions are building on the border with Turkey. Service and aircraft batteries and rocket launchers took place in various locations. This is the downing of that Turkish jet by Syria last Friday. They said again today, the Turks, that in fact they would respond with determination. Finally, our sources are saying that the government is indeed stepping up their offensive against the rebels dramatically just in the last few days. Once again today, we saw tanks in action against civilian locations said to be rebel strongholds. Regime here apparently